ವರಿಷ್ಠ ಪೆನ್ಷನ್ ಬೀಮಾ ಯೋಜನೆ ವರಿಷ್ಠ ಪೆನ್ಷನ್ ಬೀಮಾ ಯೋಜನೆ ಆಫ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಸ್ಕೀಮ್ ಹುಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಏಮ್ಡ್ ಅಟ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ಕಮ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟಿ ಟು ದಿ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಏಜ್ಡ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಅಬೌ ಯೂನಿಯನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಬಿನೆಟ್ ರೀಸೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅಪ್ರೂವಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿ ಲಾಂಚ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ವರಿಷ್ಠ ಪೆನ್ಷನ್ ಬೀಮಾ ಯೋಜನೆ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ ಜನವರಿ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ as said before the worst pension bima yojana is aimed at providing income security to the persons aged 60 years and above against a future fall in their interest income due to uncertain market conditions now the features of the worst pension bima yojana can be summarized as and the worst pension bima yojana 2017 would be implemented through life insurance corporation of india in the current financial year this yojana is open for a subscription for a period of 1 year from the date of the launch it will also provide an assured pension based on a guaranteed rate of return of 8% for 10 years Senior citizens can opt for pension on a monthly or a quarterly or a half yearly or even an annual basis under this scheme of Orista Pension Bima Yojana 2017. Under this scheme the government will pay to the LIC the differential return that is the difference between the return generated by the insurer and the assured return of 8% as subsidy on an annual basis this pension bima yojana will hopefully solve the problems faced by the elders in india the scheme basically aims to address the problems faced by the elders in india due to lack of awareness about their rights in old age many people have been compelled to live in inhuman conditions and further with a significant increase in the elderly population elder abuse has become a rampant and majority of the older couple have resigned to their circumstances for the sake of well being of their loved ones and for the sake of their own peace of mind older women in this context are more prone to suffer abuses because the factors like gender discrimination longer life span than older men and longer span of widowhood and also no source of income as traditionally most of them have been housewives these are the factors for the women folks other factors for women also include comparatively high illiteracy among elderly women and there's a lack of awareness about their rights social norms and above all their higher level of patience and tolerance therefore most elderly women remain within the four walls of their homes and majority of them are abused by their own family members therefore advocacy of old age issues at all levels of governance and most importantly implementation of policies pertaining to the protection of interests of older persons has become important however more than the government it ultimately comes down to the loved ones of the aged persons who are truly responsible for keeping them happy and healthy till their death